Justin Bieber has been looking morose for the past several weeks as he battles depression that has left him feeling super disconnected and weird. But photos emerged on Wednesday of the sorry singer in a more upbeat mood while in Newport Beach, California with his wife Haley Baldwin. The two were seen hugging and holding hands as they walked near the beach. Bieber had on no shirt as he displayed his tattoos. The Canadian wonder added red shorts over Calvin Klein underwear. Haley had on a grey crop top with tight jeans and a black cowgirl belt. Both seemed to be happy and like they are very much in love, dispelling rumors they have problems with their marriage. Earlier he looked down when he hung his head low on the beach. Baldwin also gave him a tight hug wrapping both her arms around him as he stayed in the same spot. The duo were spotted as they took their dog Oscar to a park in the beach city. Two days later the couple relaxed by a public pool at a montage in Laguna Beach where they were seen reading a Bible. Justin seemed pretty depressed at the start of the day, said a non-looker who did not wish to be named. He was really sad and at first, he was hardly talking to Haley, she was just lying on her lounger reading the Bible. A non-looker said Justin was sulking around and noticeably bummed until his mother Patty Millette showed up. The source exclusively revealed to DailyMail.com. Justin's mother showed up later in the day accompanied by another woman in black. Justin and his mom embraced for so long when she first arrived, it was about three minutes. Then they snuggled for a while on the lounger, the source said. He was rubbing his face and rubbing his eyes a lot, I couldn't tell if he was crying or not, but he did seem depressed. A little later on the couple appeared to cheer up as they spent some time in the pool and put on a playful display. On Tuesday Baldwin spoke about mental health issues. The 22-year-old Vogue model told people she thinks taking care of yourself by getting plenty of exercise is good for one's mentality. And she added that, unfortunately, psychological issues are often pushed to the side. Baldwin said, I think there's a lot of different levels of self-care like eating right, drinking a lot of water and working out. It's really good for your mentality. I think your mental health should be number one, and it falls to the side of lot. I think there's more attention on mental health these days, and I see why and I get why. I think you have to know what works for you," the Balmain model added. And getting close to the ocean calms her nerves. I think it's grounding, she said. The sound of the ocean, being in the sun, there are so many things that are healthy about the beach to me. This may be why Haley took Justin to Newport Beach this week. Justin is still receiving treatment on both coasts, but is doing okay. He is very, very focused on getting better. He wants to be in a great place for his own and Haley's sake. He is still confident that he will get there, said the pal. Meanwhile, the singer and model, who legally married in a New York courthouse in September, have postponed their wedding for a fourth time. And this time they have put their plans for a lavish wedding ceremony for their friends and family on hold indefinitely. A source told People, they will still have a wedding eventually, but this is not their focus right now. They haven't sent out any new save the dates. They will wait until Justin feels better and is excited about planning their wedding again. And it was added on Wednesday by people that Baldwin does not want to rush her spouse. They seem happy about spending a few days in L.A. Haley isn't putting any pressure on him at all. She only wants him to focus on his mental health, it was shared. His wife is not the source of his problems, it was claimed. It has nothing to do with Haley, he is very happy being married to her. It's just something else that he struggles with mentally, a source told People. He has good help around him and is receiving some treatment. He seems confident he will feel better soon. Haley has also been supportive of his treatment, she's been so supportive of him throughout this process, a source told Us Weekly. In a candid interview with Vogue earlier this year, Justin detailed how becoming so famous at such a young age had a negative effect on his mental health. He told the publication, I started really feeling myself too much. People love me. I'm the ST, that's honestly what I thought. I got very arrogant and cocky. I was wearing sunglasses inside, I found myself doing things that I was so ashamed of, being super promiscuous and stuff, 
and I think I used Xanax because I was so ashamed. And Justin also admitted he finds it hard to trust people including his now wife. He explained, it's been so hard for me to trust people. I've struggled with the feeling that people are using me or aren't really there for me, and that writers are looking to get something out of me and then use it against me. One of the big things for me is trusting myself. I've made some bad decisions personally, and in relationships. Those mistakes have affected my confidence and my judgment. It's been difficult for me even to trust Haley. We've been working through stuff. Justin previously dated Disney star and singer Selena Gomez. The teen sweetheart stated on and off for years but finally split for good in March last year.